We're in the middle of a beautiful, warm spring week that God has blessed us with. And as God sends the sunshine and the warmth, and he warms the soil, it's amazing to watch as things come back to life. You know, it's like that in the natural, and it's also like that in the spiritual. Hi, I'm Craig Fritchley with the Sanctuary in Syracuse with today's devotional. And as God pours out his spirit in your life, as God ministers to you, he will bring the potential that he's placed within your life and he will bring it to light. It will spring forth. Isaiah chapter 44, verses 1 through 4. It says, Now hear yet, O Jacob, and Israel, my servant, whom I have chosen. Thus saith the Lord that hath made thee, and that has formed thee out of the womb, which will help thee. Fear not, O Jacob, my servant, whom I have chosen. For I will pour water upon him that is thirsty, and floods upon the dry ground. I will pour out my spirit upon thy seed, and my blessing upon thine offspring. And look what happens when God does that. Verse 4, it says, They shall spring up as among the grass, as willows by the water's course. So as you watch the grass come up, and it won't be long, the lawnmowers will be going. And they'll be cutting that grass is growing. God said, just as sure as you see the grass grow out there in the natural, in the spiritual, when God pours out his spirit, when he waters the dry ground, when he brings things into your life, what he's placed within there is going to spring up. New life is springing up all around, in the natural and in the spiritual. So if you feel a little dead, if you've been having some trouble, if there's some situations that have been happening in your life, just trust God and let God help you because God knows where you're at. He knows what's going on. And when God pours out his warmth and he pours out his spirit, and he touches you, you will spring forth into new life. He'll make you a new creature. So turn to him today. If you've done wrong, ask God to forgive you and repent. If you need to be baptized, we encourage you to get to a church and be baptized in Jesus' name. And then let God fill you with his spirit and watch as your life changes, that God transforms you. He gives you a clean heart. He gives you a new spirit. He restores and renews you and helps you because God is in the restoration business and he wants new life to spring forth where it was dead and dark. He wants warmth to be where it was cold and he wants to help you today. So turn to the Lord and give him your heart. If you have any questions, we can help you. If you have a prayer need or anything like that, please send it to us because we want to see everybody come to a saving knowledge of the Lord and to have a real experience with him, a personal relationship where God fills your life and when he fills your life, everything springs up new. God bless you. Share these with others. And we'll see you on tomorrow's Daily Devotional.